Hi guys, my name is Debbie and I am an intuitive reader and I'm here today to give you your general daily message for Tuesday, October 23rd, 2018. Please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so if you are interested in a private one, all the information is down below in the description box. I also wanted to shout out to my, my newest donations here. I want to say thank you to Stephanie as well as Teresa. Thank you so much, guys. I truly appreciate it. Uh, it means a lot to me uh, for supporting me and my channel. I truly appreciate it. If anybody else would be interested in something like that, the link to the GoFundMe account is down in the description box. So let's just get started. Started. Quite an interesting uh, energy is what I'm feeling here, okay? Uh, you first start off with, if I can pick it up, the lover's card here. So major arcana, it is known as the Gemini card, so you could be or you could be dealing with a Gemini. But for the overall energy, the lover's card is known for making some type of decision in regards to love, okay? I feel that whoever this is meant for has been extremely frustrating, okay? The seven of wands to me is known for that frustration. He's literally turned... Uh, looking over at this uh, Four of Cups energy. So I feel that somebody needs to make some type of decision in regards to a frustrating situation in regards to offering some type of cup of love, okay, to somebody. To speak this truth, uh, now you have the King of Swords here. This is Air Element, Gemini, Libra, or Aquarius. You could be or you could be dealing with one. But I feel for the overall energy, somebody needs to make some type of decision that has been extremely frustrated over to speak this truth and offer that cup of love because you have the star card here. This is a wish fulfillment. This is something that you desire, okay? Right underneath that star card, you have the death card. So you, do, you definitely want some type of change you want that transformation uh, in order to get this wish of yours all right I clarified it and I feel that somebody is not happy in regards to love the five of cups to me is that change in regards to love okay the five represents that change in regards to the element of that cup so I feel that somebody wants their they just said desire their wish okay in regards to having that change in regards to a relationship here hence why that lover's card with the decision it's very frustrating for them to be able to offer that cup of love and speak their mind in regards to exactly how they feel. I feel that they want to open up, okay? I definitely feel that somebody, uh, you have the Nine of Wands. So this has been a battle to be able to do this, okay? The Nine of Wands is known for, to me, is like that frustration, been through the battle, waiting, okay? And I clarified it. Interesting. You have the Fool card. So somebody definitely out there wants a new beginning in regards to a new start with the Ace of Pentacles here as well as the Fool card. Two very nice cards here. Now, the wild thing is, is that it's kind of interesting, the messages that I was picking up. The Page of Cups is known for that communication in regards to love, okay? Now, the wild thing is, is that his back is towards this Page of Cups energy. So I feel that somebody, um, you know, they just said reciprocate. Recipro I can't say. <laughs> They, they want to return the love back, okay? Because it's towards the back of this person, there's that page of cups. So basically what this is saying to me is that somebody has offered their love to somebody out there, okay? And this person is frustrated because they know how they have to make this decision to offer that cup of love back with that four of cups energy, okay? But I feel for now, it's kind of like there's a few different messages here. They want to work on themselves. They want to work on uh, their new beginning. They want to get that ace of pentacles, okay? That new start of money, of balance, of happiness, of love, okay? But the other energy that I was picking up is that because you have the five of swords here right after it literally turned looking at this, this tells me is that you have two fives. You just said two fives. Yeah, you do have two fives. You have the five of cups here as well. So I do feel that there is going to be that completion. Okay. But the message that I was picking up is that the five of swords is known for mental anguish of going back and forth in their mind to have that change. So what this person does, this, this is the energy that I'm feeling here, is that they're focused in on their work. Okay. They're putting their energy into something, uh, they just said meaningful, okay? It's kind of like solid, you know? It's something that, you know, it's the feeling that I'm frustrated that I can't offer this cup of love, so I'm just going to use that energy and, and pound away and work on myself, work on my money, work on, you know, my happiness for myself, okay? My balance of my life, which is really money is what I'm feeling right with this, okay? But the thing is, is that while they're working during the day or whenever they're working, 
they're mentally anguished, meaning there's that cup of love, okay? Here it is. They're working while thinking, while mentally anguished, okay, over this person that they want to offer this cup of love with, okay? So basically what I'm feeling here, okay, long story short, somebody needs to make a decision in regards to a love relationship. It's been extremely frustrating for them to be able to speak exactly how they feel with that King of Swords energy as well as offering that cup of love. It is their wish fulfillment to do so, but I just heard stuck. They're kind of stuck in a situation and they're frustrated because they can actually see this new beginning of this balance of happiness and that full card of a new beginning because this person whom they are dealing with, they had a love offer, okay, that is kind of like they turned their back. Thank you. They turned this person who needs to make this decision, okay, who is frustrated, who wants to offer that cup of back. Cup of, cup of love back to them, they basically turn their back to that love offer is what they're showing me as well and telling me. So now they they, they want to put this work into getting balance, okay? But I really feel it's kind of like the energy of basically, you know what? I, I'm frustrated. I can't make this decision. I'm just going to focus on work, okay, is what I'm feeling here. Put all my energy, all my effort into work. as like a distraction. But the thing is, is that they can't, you know, they seriously can't because they're entrapped in their head, even at work here, their thoughts are in regards to constantly offering that cup of love, <clears throat> that they have to make that decision to offer that love. It, it's kind of like a messed up cycle here is what I'm feeling. Sorry, I didn't know how else to put that. But it's kind of like it that work that they're working on, you know, like actually making money work kind of thing is like a distraction for them to get them off their minds of this person whom they wish for, whom they want this new beginning with, okay? But they try to focus in on the work. It's kind of actually wild energy here. And they try to purposely put their mind focused on their work, but they're still thinking about this person is what this is saying. And they want this change in regards to a change of love, okay? Outcome card. Um, sorry, they're all over the place here. Uh, you first start off with the five of wands. So that's three. Hang on. That's three fives, right? Three fives. So that's so they want this balance. I feel that they're going to get this balance, okay? And I'll show you what I mean. Uh, they're waiting. They're frustrated. They're battling. I'm feeling that they're more so battling for a change, okay? Uh, in regards to their waiting. They're waiting for that sun. They're waiting for that bright future. They're waiting for that wish. And they have to stay strong, okay? Is what I'm feeling here. I do feel now it's pretty wild. I was going to stop at the strength card, but I just had this feeling, just keep going, just one more card, and you have the King of Pentacles. So the King of Pentacles is an earth sign, so you could be or you could be dealing with an earth sign. But for real, this is what I'm really feeling here. Yeah, you're battling. Yeah, you're waiting. Yeah, you have to stay strong with this. But I feel in the long term, okay, not today, but in the long term, you're going to get that balance. You're going to get that pentacle. This work that you're putting in is not just in regards to money, in regards to job, okay? There's a different energy with that now. It's kind of like you're working towards your future. You're working towards to get that balance back into your life again. So that way, what you're frustrated over, what you've been through in your life kind of thing, that you're literally looking over for this new beginning, you're going to get that with that Ace of Pentacles, with the King of Pentacles in the long term, okay? This, I feel, is not today per se, but what you're striving for, you're going to achieve it because the King of Pentacles is the man. He owns it, you know, and I feel that that's coming in in regards to balance back into whoever this is going through, okay, is going to have that new start. There, If you take these two cards here, there is going to be that change with that death card. There is going to be that, you know, change in regards to a love situation. That change is in regards to a wish of yours, okay? But I just don't feel that it's for today right now. I feel that right now, yeah, you're battling, you're waiting, and you're trying to stay strong is the message for today. But in the long run, what I really feel is that you're going to get that pentacle, okay? Uh, definitely, and that new beginning. You just have to continue to stay strong is what this message is all about. So that is what I have for whomever this is meant for. Please subscribe to my channel as well as click that little bell on the side to get updated information. I do weeklies as well as dailies. You guys have a great day and I'll talk to you soon.